Yo, 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 what is up, guys? What is up, guys? We are back with another Dark Man reaction. I'm gonna go ahead and wait just a little bit. Wait for y'all to go ahead and join. How was school today for you guys? Hope it was good. Hope, hope you've been studying. You've been studying. You're slacking off by watching a Prince Charming live stream. It's okay, you know, I can understand that. At least you're doing it for something important. Sorry, that was a bottle cap. All right, enough random moments. Uh, welcome back, guys. If you're new to the live streams, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. We have tons of fun. We crack plenty of jokes. Uh, don't take anything I say too seriously. Trust me, we, we just all have fun here. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. The first video we have on the queue, on the wait list, you know, Step Brothers get suspended for fighting. They instantly regret it. I went ahead and turned my fan on in case it gets a little moist in here. Ugh, I hate that word, moist. <laughs> All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Fight, 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 fight. Oh, we getting right into it? Mm. Hit him with a me right hook. Bro, the, fight, the fight's over at this point. The fight's over, bro. Look, look at his face, man. Look at his face. He looked like he went through a gang initiation. Look at him. Principal's office now. Isn't that how Jake Paul be looking after his boxing match matches that he wins? This is the third time this month you two have been sent to my office. Hey, it's not my yeah, fault. it is. Enough. I didn't do anything. Enough. Bro, you got your ass right. whooped, man. What's up with you guys? <laughs> you deal. On second thought, I don't want to know. I just wanted to stop. <laughs> nah, it was hilarious. It's like, like, bro. <laughs> you got your ass whooped and you in the same boat as the person who whooped your ass. So it's like... <laughs> Well, what did you even gain out of all this? Like, really, what did you gain? At least, at least this guy, at least he got a deal an ass whooping. But you, you had to receive the set ass whooping, and you just as much trouble as he is, man. Right here, right now, Mark. Before Darren got here, you were an exemplary student. Exactly my point. It's not me. It's him. Hey, I didn't ask to come to this dumb school, okay? Guys, you need to bring it way down. That guy, you they both hot headed. Step brothers. Oh, well, duh. Fine. We'll do this another way. They're step brothers? Oh. Why yeah. you two shake hands right now? That's not how it, it works, bro. Oh, you're supposed to spend it for a week. I mean, I'm just gonna shake your hand. Like, it's that simple. Just shake, just shake hands. Are you, are you kidding me? So what's it gonna be? Just shake hands. You got suspended? Prince are you kidding me? Overreacted. Overreacted. All you had to do was shake hands. Yell at him, not me. I didn't do anything. Look, Mark's your brother. If it's on him, it's on you too. We're not. They're they not about their bag. They're not about their bag. Because a lot of times in life, when you're doing business deals, you're, you know, you're making your connections and whatnot, you got to shake hands with some people that you may not like. You know, you, 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 you damn, I don't, ah, damn. What was that glitch? You know what I'm trying to say? Like, you, you don't have to like have extreme hate for them. They don't got to be evil people, but you may not just not like them. But you still gonna shake their hand because you know business is business. They not about they back, bro. They is not about they back. Brothers. Look, I know this move wasn't. Bro, that word was whooping my ass. Right. <laughs> Lash out. Lash out. He tripped me in the hall in front of half of the school. What was I supposed to do? I don't know. Maybe try tying your shoes once in a while. Mark. Mark. It's crazy. He he's still talking when he looks like a whole ass. Would fight like cats and dogs. Domino's you know. large pizza. That's what brothers do. With extra Stop pepperoni. Is that? Thank you. Okay, just because you two got married does not magically make us brothers. We are not even related. What am I always telling you guys? This guy looks like he went to a sp blood. Splatoon Fest. It's love. <laughs> he got, he got, he, he got Molly when we fight, We're still there for each other when it counts. Oh, he yeah. old. Well, Darren better. Hey, be hey, he the OG who, who carries the cane. You know he got a cigar. Well, oh, you know he mean on the grill. You know he know how to cook up a mean a mean T-bone steak <laughs> with collard greens on the side. Don't forget that cornbread. Man, y'all know nothing about the South, bro. We still don't know nothing about counts. the South. Yeah, well, Darren better hope he never needs me because he'll be waiting a long time. Come on, Mark. OK, Darren Seriously. and Mark. I didn't pay attention to that. What are we going to do with the two of you? Probably blame you for the whole thing. First thing we're going to do is put them to work. What? what? That's right. This suspension isn't going to be a week-long vacation. We have a project for you. Come on. You heard him. You heard him. Get up. Uh, go ahead, OG. Get foot off the couch. Get that was the OG go. walk. You got to listen to the OG. Hey, hey. Now. You're not going to let him clean up? The barbecue for the company. 
It's a big deal. <laughs> this backyard needs to be pristine before then. Yeah, I, we were about to hire some help. <laughs> now we have you. This man just this went through a UFC fight us. and it has to go, it has to go greet people. Deck sanded. And oh, please, no, it's, it's yard please work. do not forget to paint these planters. Hey, hey, it's a big deal for your mother. It's a big deal for all of us. No fooling around. And I expect this yard to look amazing. No shenanigans is what then, he's saying. Until yourselves under house arrest. No computers, no watch time, no phones, and no friends. A part should be easy for you. Hey, Darren, what did we just talk about? But he just said that. I don't want to hear it. Come on, man. Grow up, dude. From either of you. Well, come on. You got work to do. You behave. Behave. For y'all, for y'all that have those uh, who have parents who are uh, different races, how hey, how man, is it? Which ones do y'all relate to? Do you relate to the black side more or the white side more? How are y'all in competition to do yard work? That's some slave mentality. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. If I wasn't kidding, I'm not a joke like that. Damn Looney Tunes character, how do you fall on the singular brick that was there? Hey, hey, they bonding, they bonding, they bonding. They bonding, bro. Okay, that, that's all it took, man. A little montage music, um, yard work, sweat, and that's how men bond. Just a little bit of hard work and sweat. Ha, oh, it's... Uh... His face still healing up. I don't know. I don't think I'll be able to forgive you until my my face heals. <laughs> like that would be the that would be the oh, date. Man. I can't believe this, bro. Like when Mark. I can breathe when I can breathe through both nostrils, it, then we can talk. Oh, Yo, you know what it is, man. Hey, parents have me in lockdown. Ah, okay. You gotta sell them drugs. Get up, bust you out, then, right? He's always okay. he's always up to something something nefarious. Okay. All the boys is gonna be there. Come on, man. You got a title to defend. Okay, why boy got the 2K title? Screw it, man. Let's go. Come on. Wait, bro, but we're not supposed to go anywhere until we're done. Ah, uh, you know, that sounds like a you problem. Damn. Not my fault. You don't have any friends to break you out. Hey, just Damn. Like paint fumes or went to bed earlier or something. Appreciate you. Wait, bro, you really expect me to cover for you? Oh, I thought I they sure was do. bonding. I know where you sleep, man. Remember, I can make your life miserable. <laughs> I thought they were bonding, bro. Chop, chop. Come on, man. Ooh, he said Fine. chop, chop. Imagine if he said boy. <laughs> nah, you you have me so twisted if you think I'm, I'm finna finish that yard work. Is this a moment where you snitch? Hmm. That's a, that's actually an interesting uh, thought process because look, 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 guys, look. You owe him no loyalty, right? Because he gave you no loyalty. And y'all will get in trouble if the yard work isn't finished. So do you just snitch? Hmm, I don't know. Pretty soon y'all gonna, gonna start calling me gunner. Gun of the rat. I don't want. I don't want that. I don't want that. I'm not gonna snitch. I'm kidding. Have a nice night. I hope so, because you're not gonna be seeing your friends for a long time. I thought you guys were working late. And we thought we told you no going out until the yard was finished. Oh come on! I was at Chris's house for a couple hours. You were supposed to be helping your brother. He told him, didn't he? He probably didn't. I'm gonna kill him. This is not Darren's fault. Or this is did? your fault for breaking the rules. What's going on? Oh, like you don't know, snitch. What's that supposed to mean? Hey. What the heck? <gasps> what is wild about this whole situation is that this man, this man's face looks like a dartboard. It looks like a dartboard, black and red everywhere. And he is still trying to throw hands. I don't know if I should be, if I should be amazed by it. By his, his bravery? Or like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Is he stupid? Is he stupid, guys? Like, he got his ass whooped. Blood coming down the shirt. Shirt was ripped up and everything. I don't know, man. I don't know, bro. And you still try to pick a fight, man. I don't know, man. Maybe this time you really got to sit him down, uh, Darren. I think that's his name. Maybe this time you really got to sit him down. That way he doesn't step to you ever again. Nah, he probably still gonna step to him. I don't know. I, I think I think I should praise this white boy's, you know, courageous, courageous bravery. I don't know. <laughs> hey. hey. Oh, big no name.
donations, big donations in the chat. Travis Warner, thank you so much for that big dono. Ooh, he said, hey, consider this all my late fees. Also, because you're the damn best. Hey, appreciate it, bro. It's a big dono, bro. Appreciate that so much. Hey, hey, get off me. Hey, dude, are you serious hey, hey, hey. right now? You serious? Hey, bring it up. Hey, bring it up. Bring it up. So, Darren, give me a minute. Me? Me? Like, I, Mark, you still need a rhinoplasty, and you and you want to pick a fight? We're both always taking Mark's side. It's not fair. Ah, uh, the I dad loves snow bunnies. Look, this why. is our home. Yeah. And this is our family. They are your family. Ooh. You chose them. I sure why, why girls was his weakness? I know a couple yeah. OGs like that. <laughs> you got to love them. Like, look at Dad. your face. You, and Dad, you're trying wait. to box some more? Who's phone charging? Why are you That's making OG I mean. run, bro? He don't got his cane? Maybe we should just let him blow off some steam. He won't be long. What makes you so sure? I've never seen him go more than 20 minutes without looking at his phone. He'll be back. I knew Test that phone me. was important. I should be a, a detective. Hey. On my Nancy Drew. Are you okay? Sherlock Holmes yeah, type I'll be, beat. I'll be okay. Just... Hey, just give me a minute. Oh, okay. This man hot. Y'all see his y'all see his dome? That shit's shiny. Hello? You got the house to yourself uh yes yeah. yourself? It's time, it's time it's time to throw a party, man. Invite all the baddies that you know, bro. Laura? Invite all of the baddies. You can't you can't invite all your homeboys, bro. I mean you can, Mark? but like you gotta get the baddies first. Trust me, you bring the baddies, <laughs> everyone else follows. Everyone else follows. You need the baddies. I'm sorry. You got the house to yourself, bro. Or you can go ahead and, you know, pull an old American pie. Some of y'all don't get that reference. Don't watch the movie. Oh, hold on, hold on. I got to pause this. My boy Travis Werner with another huge donation, man. Appreciate that. So Appreciate that big, uh, big donation so much, bro. Ooh. You feeling mighty generous today. All right, let's go ahead and run this back. But yeah, appreciate that, Travis Warner. Big donations in the chat. Big donuts. Ah! All right, what did you just see? I didn't read the message at all. Let me get in the zone. Oh, there was no message to read. Oh, OG in the hospital. Let me guess, diabetes. Either that or high blood pressure. That's, that's, what, that's what usually gets us, man. That or black on black diamonds. All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm sorry. He's gone. Oh! <laughs> I feel so bad for cracking jokes. All right, all right, all right. The past two minutes of jokes never happened. Oh, my. They really off-screened OG. I know he feels so weird right now. Like, who is this lady hugging me? I'm so sorry. But that's his, that's the closest thing he has to family. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh. Damn. Oh. You look like Zuko a little bit. I'm sorry. <laughs> I must I must restore my honor. <laughs> I'm bringing back the heaven. I don't even. <laughs> oh. 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 Uh, y'all think I'm funny? I think I'm mildly funny. Like, there's other people funnier than me, but I'm not a bad watch. You're such a good man. I'm so sorry for your loss. Thank you. 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 I know that must be crushing for him. Oh, I don't even want to think about that. Now she's left with two kids. One isn't even hers. And oh, husband. can you imagine? No. One isn't even her. hers. Like why are you why are you airing airing our business like that, girl? I know it's obvious, but this is a funeral. It's crazy. People just gossip. People just gossip, man. You know, I, I like to partake in a little gossip too, but you know, just a little bit, a healthy amount, right? Gossip is information. Information is power. <clears throat> All right, what kind of words of hey, wisdom uh, you got for him? Mom wanted me to. Check let's hear. Let's see if it's a good one. Like you care. What's that mean? It means if you hadn't snuck out, none of this would have happened. You think this is my fault? 
<laughs> You're really something, you know that? Your dad was worried about you after you ran off. Maybe if you weren't such a baby, Ooh. you'd still be here. Yes, Ooh, another ass whooping upcoming. Sick. Stay oh, tuned. Oh. Stay oh. tuned. Don't go anywhere. Don't touch the TV Sick. remote. Oh, no, no, no. I need you to give him a good, a good whacking for me, bro. Oh, man. He got his legs back. He got his legs back, guys. Okay, Mark. Okay, okay, Zach Efron. And he went totally psycho. Look at me. Okay, he got his legs back. He got his legs back. I. Everyone keep acting like they care. We do. And no one cares. We do. We do. I know that man's what mouth tastes like straight enough? nickels. Oh, what is gonna be enough? Don't ever taste it blood. It tastes like what nickels and pennies. <laughs> Why don't you go check on Darren? You shouldn't be alone. <gasps> He's your brother, Mark. He's not my brother. He's your brother from He's another not mother. Step brother, okay? You know what he is? He's a snitch. He caused all this in the first place by ratting me out. Ratting you out. I don't think ratting you out caused the heart attack. I out with my friends the other day. You know Chris's mother called I think that told fried us chicken, that you were dude. at his house. That's how we knew. You know, Darren didn't know anything about that. In fact, he tried to cover for you. Wow. I knew he didn't snitch. You know, he may be in a white household, but he still holds the street code. Snitch, but he's still a jerk, okay? He attacked me today for no reason. Honey, I'm the opposite of a street nigga, bro. I need y'all to know that. Him. Why? What has he ever done for us? Complain about being here. <clears throat> you know, at least the mom's trying, though. We can appreciate her for trying. Uh, is there hair in my mouth? Who have I been licking? He finished it. Darren? Did he run away for a second time? Aaron, you so indecisive. What the hell? Why are you pulling up on me like that? Why are you interested in me? Relax, you know, back up, bro. He, he obviously, bad. yeah, yeah. He's up to nefarious business. Be careful out here, little guy. Someone might come and try to take it from you. If you, if you really get your back hey! taken like this. Get your hands off him. What are you gonna do about it? Mess around jump your and ass. find out. Okay. Okay. Wow. Wow. Nah, man. All your pit points, take it back. All of your player uh points, take it back. Bro, what? He bucked at you? And you actually got scared? You got intimidated? You got startled? Oh no. Bro, like you really got startled by this cast member of Greece? Oh gosh. Where are you going, man? You ain't gang, bro. You suddenly care. You ain't gang. Fuck, <laughs> man. Sorry, okay? For accusing you of snitching on me. For leaving you to finish the planner by yourself. I should have jumped his ass. I, I should have done that. I don't know about you, bro. Let's just get out of here and go home, okay? And with a Please. Meek, 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 meek. Dad's gone now. You guys don't have to act like you want me around anymore. We're not family. Yes, we are. As a wise person once said, <clears throat> family's not about blood. It's about love. What do you it's say? About love, guys. Can you come home now? Brother? That was a good one. 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 That was um, stepbrothers get suspended for fighting. They instantly regret it.
O Leroy Jenkins, my boy Leroy Jenkins. Thank you so much for that donation. He said, Prince, you're the best YouTuber. Also, when is the next Wolf Among Us episode? It will be this week. Uh, maybe tomorrow, maybe Saturday, but it will be this week. So either tomorrow or Saturday. Boom. Promise you. I prom I'll promise that for y'all. All right, let's go ahead and get into the next one. We got Millionaire Goes Broke Overnight. Damn. He go broke overnight. Uh huh. What happens next is shocking. Who is your financial what advisor? Be all for you. You need um, to go and round you know up. A group Maybe of, I'll take another lap around. The a store. group of people who have nothing to do for the day and whoop his ass. Your bro. wife sure loves to shop, huh? <laughs> yeah. Um, nothing, would you people with nothing to do with the day uh, include uh, people who spend sure. all day playing 2K. Thanks. People who. Uh, Borrow their girl's car to drive her to work while they stay at home, smoke weed, and play 2K. And uh, people play 2K. Oh, oh, I know what this is. This is the uh, 2008 financial crisis. You really need to get all of that? Or 2000. Oh, well, I thought you were just close to big deal. I mean, yeah, but the escrow hasn't closed. That means that I don't get paid for like another week. Maybe we should just like kind of. It'll be fine. You know what? Maybe you could just use your credit card. She's the devil okay. on your shoulder, bro. God sent you a sign, and the All devil right. swayed okay. you away. She swayed you away. Uh, oh, she swayed you away, man. Yeah, this is definitely the 2008 uh, financial crisis. So, so what do you think? It's perfect. <laughs> I know. I love this house. I've had my eye on this for a while. It's, it's a dream home. Hey, don't try to outbid us now. <laughs> hey, I couldn't even if I wanted to. This is way out of my income bracket. <clears throat> so, can I Real estate agents just, just be lying, bro. <laughs> Let's have your income 3 bracket. 3.2 million? Ooh, maybe but it is. The asking is four. Yeah, but you've seen the news. The economy is on its way down, so might as well lowball them. See what they say. Wow. Oh, that's so crazy. That's so crazy because people need money, right? Because they can't. They they can't. Um, you know what? I'm not even gonna try. I'm not gonna try. But what, from what my understanding is, people can uh, afford their homes anymore because you know they took out all of these loans. Loan rates went up. They couldn't afford it no more. Uh, banks foreclosed on their houses. Uh, or some people were trying to sell their homes. That way they can, uh, you know, avoid bankruptcy, you know, have some money in their pocket. And then the only people who could buy homes are people who are cash rich, which looks like they, y'all don't care about this lesson. Y'all just want laughs and hurt. Have you heard from the bank yet about our That's all y'all want. Not yet. Um, <laughs> but with your 800 credit and your 20% down, it should be a slam dunk. 20% like so, uh, down? I wouldn't have to worry about, well, Wish Looks I like the bank's ears now. must be ringing. I <laughs> will be able to. Cal, give me the good news. I got, I got to get more po positive mindset. What do you mean not approved? Ooh. What's what's going on? Are they not approved or are you not approved? Am I approved? Down 1.7 percent here, loss of 37 points or so. Oh, this is scary because it's like morning. kind of well, happening in real life three, right now. Four and a half percent generally across these markets. Oh my gosh. Let's talk about the speed with which we are watching this market deteriorate. We're red everywhere, essentially down by four, five percent. We're down over 16 percent. Mm. God, Dad, this piece won't fit. This is so scary, guys. Like, look, I'm sure you're gonna find the right piece. People say we headed towards a recession right now, man. Interest rates are at an all-time high. Nobody can afford houses. This one won't the feds raised the uh, the ten-year. Uh, okay, y'all don't care. Hey, hey, man, you're gonna figure it out. Hey, but what do I always tell you? If you stick don't with tell mommy enough, about the redhead. It will <laughs> eventually work out. Yeah, that's right. So. Oh, and Squirtle. Who was y'all's first choice as a starter Pokemon? Yes! I you chose Bulbasaur? <laughs> Stephanie is cooking, so we should go right now. I want to get there early before the reservation. So I'm going to start calling people that. Pictures out front. <laughs> like, if I'm trying to insult you, I'm just going to be like, you probably picked Bulbasaur as a kid. 
Didn't you? Ain't you? Wanna <laughs> show off my new bag? What is that, Chanel? Yeah, I was thinking maybe we should just cancel the babysitter. You know, I mean, we could stay in today. I'll make us something. Giovanni's is just so expensive. You would pick I mean, this Oh, freaky ass. thing going on right but now. You just closed that big deal. I did. It just choice. hasn't hit yet. I talked to escrow, and they're saying it any minute now, so. My homie, so we'll you, you, you's not getting that money, bro. Dad, you, you's not getting paid. I don't want you to go. That check not hitting your account. I know. I'm sorry, bud. Look, uh, I'll play with you when I get back, okay? Okay. All right, bet. Wow, this is the babysitter. you guys look great. She's not a redhead. Ew, not bad for five months pregnant, huh? <laughs> <laughs> We're going on a lunch date. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like get you. Go. Thank you, Mr. Woods. That was Aren't your. Are you gonna tip her? Yeah, of course. <laughs> This man, this this man struggling, bro, and like his wife. Go. Thank you. And his wife don't even care. Lady. This is why you can't marry an expensive girl, bro. Mm. Hell no, nah, man. Delish. Drain your whole bank account, you divorce you, and get with somebody else. We should stop by Mastro's on the way home for their butter cake. I'll see if Stephanie can stay an extra hour. No, I think we should get going. I promised Timmy that I'd hang out with him, so. I'm sorry, sir, but your uh, debit card didn't go through. Ooh, it's don't weird. say it too loud. Oh, your voice. Damn, you just lost your tip. You know what? I can't you even pay for this meal, so you're going to have to caught me. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Yo, have y'all ever been in this kind of situation where, like, the bill has arrived and you know in your head, like you haven't given your card to the uh, waitress yet. You haven't gave her gave her uh, the card yet. But you know in your head, you do not have the money to pay for this. Maybe the bill came out a little larger than you thought what it was supposed to be, or maybe you thought you would just some way and somehow finesse it, or you'll just think about it later. Man, it is the worst kind of anxiety ever. Ah, it only happened to me once. It only happened to me once. She ended up having to pay. And it, I swear, it wasn't because I was broke. It was because my cards weren't working. But, you know, for all she knows, I was broke and I was lying and making it up. So, yeah, I had I had a moment like that. Back to the video. Hi, uh, Kathy, it's Alex. Yeah, um, uh, any update on the wire? It seems like it's still not in my account. Like, where my money the at? bank's never funded. Everyone just signed the docs. Here it is, oh. man. Here it is. No, I didn't. I didn't know that. I did not know. Oh, okay. All right. Thank you. Woo! Washington Mutual, the bank that was going to do the loan, just shut down. The deal's dead. Ooh. What? I know. I know. The whole I ass bank shutting down, guys. You only afraid. I have no idea what we're gonna do now. I Be afraid. No well, worst case scenario, there's a lot of equity in our house. You have that, you do have that. Okay, and is there any additional income, such as your wife? Uh, no, she, she's- She, she don't work, the... she don't cook, Another she don't clean. Great. <laughs> She'll nag, okay, she, she, she um, know how, how to do that though. And see what we can do. Thank you. You better walk out and say and just I laugh with his coworkers. <laughs> we can't do shit for them. <laughs> this is an ideal. They out there slapping their knee. When Corey arrives, maybe we can have your mom move in with us. You know, so you can work. Wow. They've been talking about this great recession for years now. I'm worried. I I just don't think it's a good idea for my mom to live with us. Or do you really you just not want to work? Barely handle her for a weekend. Okay, maybe she really just does have beef with you the know, mom. Once his second loan goes through in the house, that should hold us over till everything goes back to normal. Ah, uh, taking a loan on your house, man? You don't pay back the loan. <laughs> GG's, move out, bro. You homeless. You homeless. I just spoke to my manager and- I don't know if I could ever risk that. Unfortunately, Mr. Reynolds, you are not approved. 
He knew you and weren't approved before before he even years. asked Mr. You know Mr. Reynolds. Clients I brought here for loans. He just I mean, walked out as a courtesy. That you can do something. If it's my income, that's the problem. No, no, no it's not just that. Ah, he says it's not just that. <laughs> You're underwater. You see, Ooh. your current mortgage balance is higher than your home's worth. That's not possible. I just got it appraised six months ago. I have at least 200K in equity. Maybe six months ago. Not today. Mm. Everything's changing. Scary, scary, scary times, scary hours, man. This whole, Hello. this whole, this whole I man's life is, is just crashy. Last payment of five hundred and sixty-eight dollars didn't go through. He about to lose his beamer, bro. Alex is stressed, but what he doesn't know is things are about to get a whole lot worse for him. Damn, Darman, bro, give my guy a break. <laughs> Bro, Darman, that was devilish. He <laughs> said Alex is stressed, but what he doesn't know is things are gonna get a whole lot worse for him. Like, damn, what did, what did Alex do to Darman, bro? <laughs> he doesn't know is things are about to get a whole lot worse for him. Hey, when it rains, it pours, More right? Banks close as the real estate industry tanks. Woo. Before long, Alex starts falling behind on bills. Very scary feeling, Eventually, right? Eventually, he can't keep up and ends up losing his home. With a baby on the he way. He moves into a small oh, apartment for man. his family of three, soon to be four. Oh, she yodeling? Oh, oh, she's going through a... Uh, his what? baby boy, Corey, <laughs> arrives. All right, Even another boy. It's supposed to be one of the happiest days of his life, Alex feels something he's never felt before. Stress. A panic attack. Oh, Ooh. It's so bad that he has to rush out of the Oh room. my gosh. Those are terrible His guys. His heart races. I've, ha I've had, had those before. He's having a hard time breathing. He can't believe his financial problems are now turning into health problems. I've had those before, man. Those are scary. As the pressure mounts, Alex now has to rely on prescription medication to help him with his anxiety just to make it through the day. And this is the like unspoken stress that men go through. Men go through this unspoken stress, right? It's crazy. We're expected to be providers. We're expected to, you know, know a lot of things or at least more than let me not say the woman, but you know, we're expected to be better y'all know what exactly what i'm trying to say i'm just not trying to get canceled but <laughs> nobody ever talks about how stressful how hard it can be like having to balance all these juggle all these things trying to plan a secure future trying to plan everything out while still trying to remain logical while still trying to navigate this world while still trying like we really do a lot and then a lot of times like it's let me not say a lot of times. Let me say sometimes it's frowned upon for a man to show emotion to, you know, for him to have anxiety, for him to be stressed, for him to have a panic attack. They used to call that a, 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 a hissy, a hissy fit, something like that back in the day. I don't know. It's just crazy, man. Like men deal with a lot of stress and most of us, we don't even talk about it. Talk to your friend today. Talk to them today. Ask them if they stressed out. If they are telling them to uh, watch Prince Charming. Anxiety Michelle, just to make it through the day. I'm not a doctor. Uh, that wasn't a, a legal uh, binding. A few uh, years go by, and Alex isn't ready to handle what's about to come next. Hey, Dad. Since you closed that new deal, do you think we can go to Universal Studios sometime? You got Universal oh, Studios yeah. money? Please, please, please. Well, uh, guys, you know, it was a small deal, so it's just enough to hold us over. So I think we should just. Alex. Hey, uh,. Timmy, can you watch your little brother for me? At least his wife stayed with him. I mean, I guess it's because she was pregnant and like two kids hey. and you know, you can't just start um, a new life like that. You know how I've been feeling really nauseous lately? Are you knocked up again? I what it was. We're pregnant. Oh my gosh. Did you believe it? I was like totally shocked. What? Like this can't be right. What this are you, a heifer? Heifer is a cow. Right. 
House gives multiple bursts, right? Or is it just one? This is the panic panic attack is coming in, bro. Bro, you would think she's Latina by the way she be getting pregnant. I swear. I mean, you look at a Latina, she she get pregnant. Trying for a girl, right? <laughs> um, no, I'm. You gotta avert your gaze, man. Yet. When I walk, when I used to shop oh, no, at Fiesta, y'all know that uh, store Fiesta. You gotta walk through the store like this. <laughs> oh man! I just feel all, like a horrible father and husband. No. Not that bad, bro. Don't ever say that. Yeah, you do. I know fine. you've been so stressed out lately in the past few years, but you know, I'm gonna be by your side no matter what. And I know I said no to this before, but my friend Maggie ah! works at a marketing company. Ah! And they're hiring, so ah! <laughs> I'm thinking about applying. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Y'all did not hear what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all did not hear anything. The cost of the nanny would be your salary alone, so I mean, what's, what's the point? See, when you're depressed and like that, you become very I need pessimistic. To this. I need you to feel get like this by myself, okay? And you also feel like you gotta do everything on your by yourself. Like, nah, money. man. You have a support system for a reason. You can rely on them. You can ask them for help. Yeah, tell your sons that I don't know. Uh, what, what, what jobs do boys have? Sell lemonade? In the street corner? What are you looking for, a gat? Oh, he's looking for his pills. I don't ever want to get to that point in my life. Lord forbid. God, I beg you to never... Are you okay? No, I'm not okay! Everything's all right, bud. I'm fine. Tad, but you, you gotta keep it strong you with your kids. Strong. Can you just please tell me? It's just that... These past few years has been really hard. Ever since the real estate industry crashed, it just... <clears throat> my friends and my co-workers even told me, just move on. Just find another field. Just wish that I would listen to them. A long time ago, man. Give up? Oh, so he stayed in real Dad, estate. you can't give up. That goes against everything that you stand for. What do you mean? The things you always told me when I was young. Or Remember hit a ball those? or ride a bike. Hey, look at you. If you stick to something long enough, then it'll eventually work out. Guys, and listen to what he just said, man. That and you didn't mean it. The more you work towards something, like you will be shocked at the really results did. that you get. Then you can't give up. I believe in you. Luck You're definitely the is involved. And hardest working person I know. Oh my god. You figure man. this out. I promise. I love you, bud. What a good son Thank right you, there, Dad. man. Thank you so much. What a good son. <clears throat> Look. You know what? Why don't we go over there? Right? It's over there. Oh. Her. <laughs> no, I'm With a little I'm boost from his son. Alex decides to keep on fighting and never give up on his career. All right, so how does he make that bread? Even though he continues to struggle with self-doubt and anxiety, Ooh. he pushes himself through it and keeps on working. That's what you gotta do, man. Anxiety will eat you alive. Don't let it, don't let it win. Several months Be later, victorious. he welcomes his first baby girl, Bridget. He's I'm excited. <laughs> I'm getting a vasectomy. <laughs> As soon as that baby come out, bro. Hey, doc, snip me up. I already got three kids and I'm broke. I need money. I'm broke. Snip me up, my good, my good sir. Like three, and like I already have three kids. That's plenty enough. But I don't need more. More kids means more expenses. The pressure keeps building up for Alex, even though his family does everything they can to support him. Several years pass and Alex continues to struggle. But little you know, did he know several things years were about to change. Several years dealing with this. <laughs> I, I don't hey, even think I can make it a year. Sorry I'm late. Golly, they're all old. 
Like everybody's. This man has been stressed for a minute. Oh my gosh, Alex. I'm so sorry, bro. Look at the oldest son right there. He gotta be at least 17, right? 18? Oh my, I'm so sorry, Alex. Yeah, he has been stressing for a minute. I'm surprised you still have your hair. Fighting over uh, toilet paper. Did you paper, make a deal with the devil? Cleaning products. Anything but your hair? People are preparing for the apocalypse. Oh, kids, could you go in the other room? I want to talk to your dad about Oh, I think he's talking about uh, what happened in, you know, 2020. So it's been that long, bro. Woo! I'm so sorry, Alex. You saw the notice on the door. Yeah, I did. Look, I'm closing in on a deal, and that should hold us off for a while. I just can't help but thinking that it's only going to get worse. I mean, everything is closing down. Restaurants are completely shut down. Yep, he's talking about 2020. I don't see a in real estate. I don't. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. But either way, we're going to figure it out. Yeah. Have you guys seen the news? It's on the news. Dozens of industries, Look. but when it comes to real estate, Southern California houses are moving like never before. That's crazy. The statewide median home price. It dropped down. The prices went down. People bought houses. Nearly 17% from December. Because that's the exact time I bought my house, bro. During uh, the whole 2020 phase. Um, yeah, that's when I bought my house. Prices went down. Interest rates were killer. So yeah, this luck is about to turn around. Oh, oh. The pandemic is actually away. helping real estate. I, I, I would have never imagined that this would happen. Well, it makes sense because everybody's being forced to work from home now. And you start thinking, interest rates are low. So. Start thinking long term, you know? That's the exact reason why I got mine. I was like, I'm not finna pay for an apartment. Don't know yeah, what the hell's finna go on next year. You list your house in Bakersfield? Yeah, I'm the guy. <laughs> no, I could set something up real. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Oh, oh, hold on for a second. Hey, Chris. Yeah, it's been a while. I... On sunset, of course. After over 10 years of barely scraping by, Alex's real estate business is about to turn around. Over the next couple Ooh, of years, he okay. closed more deals than ever. Okay, he makes Alex. More in a month than he used to in an entire year. All right, you don't have to flex on but us like that, Alex. Deals you closes, have to flex on us like that. He could have never imagined wow. this next one would be his wow, own. Wow, Alex. So, what do you think? So this is how you move in, Alex? Okay, okay, That's Alex. Incredible. I see how he moving. New listing, Dad? He moving well, with style. my new listing? Well, <laughs> It's our new home. <laughs> this is the best. I know. Oh. Is that private security? Alex. Oh. It's him. Long time, huh? The guy who wouldn't give him a loan. I heard this house was on the market. Hey, if you have any qualified buyers, I'd love to help you with the loan. You're going to get a loan He doesn't from need you. a qualified buyer. He is the <clears throat> buyer. Oh, well, if you're looking to get in, I can finance you. The banks are really eager to loan right now, so I just uh, closed on escrow yesterday. Oh my all gosh! Cash, but thanks. Don't do it, Alex. I appreciate it. Don't do it to him. All Don't cash. do it to him. Wow! All cash. Yes. Congratulations. <clears throat> Filthy. Gross. If you ever need to pull any cash out? Okay, now get off. Get off my property. Home. Turn around and get off my property. Out. Oh, meat rider. I'm gonna okay, hesitate well, every single time to reach out. You. Yeah. That's all I'm gonna do. All I'm gonna do is I'm hesitate. Sorry. Oh my gosh. I can't help but wonder. I mean, how'd you do it? I Last you. time I saw you, you, you were in me. a pretty bad spot. Yeah. Honestly, I thought you'd give up on this real estate stuff just like so many other people have. Yeah, I was. Then my son, he reminded me that if you stick with something long enough, then eventually work out. <laughs> I still can't believe, I mean, after all those years of struggling, how we're here right now. What a come crazy. up, bro. What a come up. It's God's blessing. Amen. Well, again, congrats, Alex. I'm happy for you guys. First thing I'll do, walk around butt naked in that house. <laughs> you know, of course, without so my guys, family there. I have one more surprise for you, all right? Tickets to Universal Studios. Oh, go to Universal Studios. 
we're gonna go and I've actually never been. House, I don't know then, how fun uh, we'll it is. Let out. me know. Right. You've been to Universal, let me know. Is it fun? Is it lit? Is that is that where all the cool kids go? All the cool cats, the jive cats? I am so proud of you. She's gonna let you beat her cakes of smithereens Since tonight. Since we're going to Universal, I know there's gonna be a lot of crowds there. Do you need your... I don't need them. I don't. I've been working out, I've been meditating. I feel better now than I ever have. I feel so good that I think that we should talk maybe about having maybe more number kids? four. Whoa, okay. Well, my dear, what are you, Mormon? I a different kind of pill. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, three is more than I can handle. <laughs> this man, Alex, said, do you want my batter? <laughs> you want my baby batter? Do you want my baby batter? Be better. Barbie saw it. What? <laughs> oh my gosh. Mike, thank you so much for that donation, bro. Appreciate you so much. You know, this man, Mike, he gave his own hard earned cash. Guess what? Guess what Mike wanted to tell the whole world, or at least the stream. Guess what he wanted to tell the stream? Poop. He spent two Canadian dollars of his hard earned money to say poop. Well, poop to you too, sir. I appreciate that dono. Big D Gold Chain, thank you so much for becoming a member of Charming. Ugh, got you a nice little membership. I love that, appreciate that. Yo, if you are watching this stream right now, or maybe if you're watching it like at a future time, hit that subscribe button. Your boy likes to uh, do these streams a lot. I like to do try not to laugh streams, do videos, do reactions, do a lot of things. So subscribe right now. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do like a little giveaway. I don't know. I, I, I'm feeling a little energetic. I want to give something back to y'all. See, y'all have done a lot for me. I want to give something back to y'all. So, you know. This is the haircut I hit want. Hit that subscribe button. Oh, I don't think that's a good idea, honey. <clears throat> Why? It's her it's hair. It's my sweet 16 and you never even let me cut my hair. Okay. Because I know got you're going to regret it, Rita. Well, we can do a fun color, maybe. Or some streaks. Mm. I don't think that's a good idea either. Her hair 16. is super sensitive and she has to use these special products or she gets a reaction. Wait, the title of this video is Daughters Trade Both Their Moms. They instantly regret it. That's probably going to make sense. How about just a nice wash and set? I always get that. Why can't you be more like Thea Rosa? She Ooh. likes Camila get whatever she wants. Ooh. I don't me, Camila. They're your nails. Do whatever you want. Uh, can I have these in a size 7, please? Oh. Um, I'll do the Barbie pink then. Perfect. Are we thinking so, jail, dude? She wants her mom to have more input while the other one wants her mom to have less input. So they're both not satisfied with what they got and they both want what the other person has. Ain't that ain't that hilarious? That's that's a whole that that is funny as hell. Just think for a moment. Someone probably is wishing they have what you have while you're over here sitting wishing that you had what someone else has. Nobody is satisfied with what they have. Crazy, right? Oh, um, mom, which one should I get? Oh. Uh, you don't care. I'm probably busy. Oh, perfect. I'll be right there. Yeah, she's busy. You know she what, she, she a working mom. I gotta go. I'll see you soon. Okay? Bye, honey. But you didn't tell me which. Um. She hung that phone up fast as hell. Great. As soon as she hung up the phone, she's like, Ugh. I'm so mad at my mom. She called again. Cut my hair. <laughs> You're so lucky your mom listened to you. Why do moms more? hate their daughters, and man? Get acrylics. I don't know. I'm starting to regret it. I can't even send a text. Ugh. Honestly, she got, this, she got them sweetie nails. Cares. I could shave my head and she wouldn't even notice. The nails you can't wipe your ass with. I'd take the Amarta over my mom any day. I don't know what to do with her, Rosa. She won't listen to anything I say. Well, you lecture like mom, that's why. Give her some freedom. Rita's smart and she's responsible, unlike Camila. Camila's a really good girl. I would trade you for a week any day. Are you serious? Woo! Because I will. Ali, man. Um, yeah! If I didn't know any better, I would think that this was your 16th birthday. That dress <laughs> is way too young for you. <laughs> Don't be jealous. Sixteenth birthday. Girl, stop. That dress is way too young for you. Stop hating. No, nah, nah, she looking good in that dress. Stop hating. Stop hating. Yo, you, some of your biggest haters be your best friends, bro. Nah, I think that dress looks just right for her. You know, she ain't too young. She ain't too old for it. Shit. Uh, 
Don't be jealous just because I can still kind of pull this off. <laughs> Kinda. Mom, we have to go. We have to get back to the Airbnb to pack and our flights in three hours. Oh, I hadn't realized. We'll be fine. No, we won't. That's how we missed our flight here. De Marta, please talk some sense into her. Camila's right. You need to go pack. LAX has a lot of traffic. There goes the drill sergeant, always telling people what to do. Well, Damn! It's my situation. It's like I'm the parent, she's the child. No, I can feel both sides though. I can feel both sides. Right. Like, I had strict Daddy, parents, and I kind of wanted to have like more Sheesh. like you know, less restricting parents. So it's pros and birthday, cons to both. I was thinking maybe it would be nice to add some sort of charity aspect, maybe like a book drive. He's like, ew! I don't what? want to help poor people. That Gross. is literally so lame. What I it's say? It's my sweet sixteen, not Mother Teresa's. I can feel her though. Like, if it was my Whoa, 21st birthday, look how cute Zendaya's hair. I ain't trying to go this to the soup kitchen. This is exactly what I want. And what's so wrong about it? You want to look like Zendaya? Rita, Good luck. The hair conversation is over. And how many times do I have to tell you to not have your phone at the table? Please put it away. I'm so sick of your rules. My friends don't have to look like this, so why? You know what? You know what's insane? Her rules are not even that crazy. Like the whole no phone at the table. That can be a little annoying. Like. You know, I get a little leeway for that, but she is acting like this mother is smothering her. Maybe, maybe I just don't understand because of the whole hair thing. Like, I think she looks normal with this, but maybe she wanted something with streets. She wouldn't look like Hannah Montana, essentially. <laughs> and her mom was like, no, girl, like, I know how it's going to look when you get it done and you go hate it. Trust me. But she's overreacting way too much for, you know, what I see as motherly love. What a little bit of, of control do I? issues. Because I am not your friend's mom. I'm your mom. And as long as you live in this house, you will follow my rules. I hate how you're so controlling. Sometimes I wish I didn't even have to live in this house. The streets are available. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What was that all about? Just Rita thinking she knows more than me like usual. Is it my fault? Do I care too much? Should I act more like Rosa so she'll actually miss me? Right. Or you could swap daughters for a bit. Then she would probably miss you too. You fucking creep. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm you kidding. Know, Rosa said the same thing. Really? Yeah. I thought she was kidding. He but saw the I chance and he took it. <laughs> I'm kidding though. A terrible idea. Hmm. That joke never happened. <laughs> oh, I can't do anything with these nails. This is so annoying. Yeah, I was wondering why you got them so long. Because you didn't care. Maybe if you cared a little more, like, dear Martha with Rita, this wouldn't have happened. Oh, will you just stop? <laughs> I'm trying to get some peace before our flight, and you're just stressing me out. Oh, I'm sorry. Just do your yoga. I'll take care of myself like I've been doing the past 16 years of my life. Oh, what you there is think? definitely cons to both kinds of, you know, mothers we're... Hi, Camila. Seeing. Is your mom here? Which one would y'all rather have? Come in, come in. Would you rather have the controlling one? Uh, put it in the chat right now. Would you rather have the controlling one or would you rather have the, you know, laid back one? Laid back or controlling? Laid back, controlling. Laid back, controlling. Honestly, I'll take the laid back one. I grew up with controlling parents. I love them. I love them to death, man. Like, I still talk to them almost every day. I love my parents. But growing up, like, they, oh my gosh, like, I had to stay in the house. I could barely go and visit my friends. I wasn't allowed to have friends over, wasn't allowed to have a pet. But the whole pet thing, you know, I can understand, you know, some people really aren't animal people. But it was, it was wild, bro. Some of y'all are actually saying controlling. The ones I'm assuming who are saying controlling, y'all probably don't have a much uh, parental guidance in your life that you're, you know, you're missing, you're missing out on it, which I can respect. And I feel sorry for you. But damn, bro, controlling parents, like, you know, you love them, but it's also like, golly, like, let me live my life. Let me do my thing. You know, I'm not you. I'm me. Hey, sis. hey so were you serious earlier? This this man, Katie, said laid back because you know <laughs> Switching places for a week. So you want oh, your mom to have a yacht? Or a lifetime. Wait, what's going on? Water, kids. Camila, honey, how would you like to stay with me for a week? Well, that sounds amazing, but um, what about my party? 
You can have yours at our house and I can have mine with your mom in Vegas. That way I won't have someone trying to control everything. Be careful what you wish for. You're gonna let a 16-year-old go to the Vegas? The grass isn't always green around the other side. Even I don't think that's a good idea. Look, this Plus, grass is pretty much What can you do in Vegas? Hey. You can't do anything fun okay, at 16 in Vegas. Let's go for it now. Now. Let's do it. Pack up. Remember, don't talk to any strangers. Protect your documents and don't leave your bags unattended. You sound like TSA mom. I'm this is my mom right here, bro. I'll be fine. This is my mom Get right off here, bro. My keys. And like I, we we, we love goodbye, them. We love them. Too, it's just like it's just like. Oh, honey, damn, her mom didn't even say goodbye. Her mom didn't even say goodbye. Y'all catch that? I love goodbye to you too, mom. <laughs> her mom in her own zone. She got the neck pillow, the air pauses. She probably got her favorite podcast loaded up. Oh, she in her own zone. <laughs> got no time for any of that. Any of that fuck shit. <laughs> she even turned around, bro. That's cold. No, nah, that's cold. That's a woman who did not want that kid. <laughs> so, what are we thinking? Woo! Like? Yes, I love it. Oh it's perfect God. for my party. What do you think, Thea? Uh, um, yeah, it's great. Yeah. yeah, can you believe Becky G wore that to the VMAs? <gasps> okay, if you're ready to book it, I just need a signature and we're good to go. Oh, oh, oh girl, did you get that photo I sent you? Yeah. I thought the same thing. You know what? I gotta take this. It's really important. Damn, she, she she loved the gossip. You can decide. I trust you. I know. I saw the TMZ interview as well. It's totally crazy. Ah, uh, she's one of those uh, shade room girlies. Is it okay if I take it home? Not worth the gap. I've never signed a contract before. Sure, but you don't yeah, want you reading it. This space won't be <laughs> Look at him. He's wearing a purple shirt, bro. That is textbook villain. Don't trust him. Just like a pimp name slip back. Just like Waluigi. Oh. He even had a pen ready for you. Don't sign that contract. You're probably signing over all your feet pics. He definitely scammed y'all. I know it. He did something. <laughs> Thanks for coming with me. My mom usually doesn't have time for stuff like this. Aw. I'm not used to that. I'm glad somebody actually wants me around. Aw. So, what do you That's think so about That's so sweet, this? man. This is going to make me call so my mom after, after this. I'm, they're really nice. She wants to say hell no. We know. But that. I'm we thinking know. maybe just a little bit too revealing. Oh, <laughs> my mom usually doesn't care what I wear. But <laughs> maybe you're right. Yeah. I saw that face. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I know your mom. I like that. Oh, how about something like this? It's so sophisticated, but also so fun. It would look great on you. Is she finna pull out a Harriet Tubman dress? I cannot believe you're letting me cut my hair. I've been wanting to do it. this for forever. I say it's your life. Do whatever you want. No parental guidance. Wow. You know, you will look good with a little bit of color, too. Ooh, girl, do you don't wanna do it. you want to dye your hair? I would. Don't do a major I've change right before a party, man. Incident. That's stupid. What do you think, yeah? Oh, um, I think you should stop worrying about it and make your own decisions. I'm gonna go next door and get a matcha. <laughs> no, the yacht is leaving. Come back, yacht. Um. Yeah. Yeah. I guess we could just see where it goes. Copyright, 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 copyright. Man, turn that off! Turn my money! Um, Thank I was you. Picking music for the party. Oh, well, would you mind if I made some suggestions? Really? I love that. I was thinking about adding some Megan the Stallion, Ice Spice. What were you thinking? Um, Ice Spice. I was thinking <laughs> something more. <laughs> Bro, that's you, that is so insane to me, man. Like, I love Ice Spice, bro. You know, she she look good. Ice Spice, oh, she look good. But really, would you really want your kids listening to her music? Like, let's be honest with ourselves. Her, Meg Thee Stallion, Cardi B, uh, shit, Nicki Minaj. 
Like, if you listen to the music these female rappers be saying, oh my gosh, I don't think they can get go three three bars without saying something about their vagina, bro. I, I promise you. I promise you. It, it, it's insane. And like, Ice Spice got her whole dance in it. Y'all know what the Ice Spice twerk? Pretty soon you're going to see that shit on Fortnite. I'll purchase it, though. <laughs> Every time I drop somebody, I'm just going to do that Ice Spice twerk. Fortnite, you heard it here, man. I'm telling you, if they add the Ice Spice twerk, <laughs> is there a way to do custom emotes? How long the lines go? I need to investigate. Beethoven. <laughs> it's a beat. It's classy. There's no swear words. I think everyone will love it. But... It's a sweet 16. We want to turn up. Yeah, oh, mom, you're, 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 you're bugging. See? This ain't the 16th no, century. No. no. Come on, mom. Beethoven. Not even you know with what? a trap beat Why either. Why just let me worry about the playlist, okay? <laughs> I am not going to let you worry about no playlist. Oh, I'll be worried if I let you worry note, about the playlist. I have a surprise for you. I invited somebody very special to your birthday party. Wait, like a celebrity? You'll just have to wait and see. Probably gonna be like the worst person who could possibly, possibly be there. Maybe her dad? I don't know. You get up immediately on, after an alarm and you just, you just get out of bed that quick and turn on lights? Oh my. Oh my gosh, my hair! Oh, what, oh what's my with God. all the commotion? How did it's that even happen? It's a disaster. Uh -uh. Oh, it can't be that bad. It is bad. Oh. Ah! It is that bad. Wow, you're right. Uh, it looked like a, it looked like a what candy corn. What happened? I must have got like a reaction from the dye or something. Oh, was she, it, was she trying to look like Ice Spice or something? This never happened. I don't My know. My hair's ruined. Uh, you know what? It's way too early for all this complaining, Rita. Especially before coffee. Who does she look coffee. like? Just Who does she look like? Fixed. I can't. Today's my party. I can't think oh. of anybody. Your party's today? Wow, you definitely don't have time to get it fixed then. <laughs> How did I not think of that? Lois Griffin! Lois Griffin! Lois Griffin! Peter! <laughs> that is Lois Griffin in the flesh! How, like, I don't know why that didn't register. I was like, this looks like somebody, but I can't put my finger on it. It's Lois Griffin, guys! <laughs> Yo, they actually have Lois Griffin on Darman, bro. This man Darman, bro. He's going Maybe places. He's going places. Peter! She was screaming. That was the episode where uh, Peter, uh, <laughs> he did something with Lois' mom. We don't know for sure, but. Hey, Martha, can you please <laughs> change you know. the music? Everyone's so bored. You really went with this playlist? Can you please play hip hop? Oh my gosh. Honey, hip hop is full of profanity. Hell yeah, That's not what young people should be listening to. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Why don't we play some games? Come on, I mom. Set up musical chairs. Don't you know, like, this it's not cool to read books no more? Not preschool. We trying to tote blocks. Like, come on, come you on, mom. What? I think it's time for the special guest. That'll liven things up. Who's a special guest? Everyone, Mr. Rogers? Are you ready for your special surprise? Who's it gonna be? Okay, please welcome the Little Mermaid. Happy birthday, Camilla! <laughs> Do you wanna sing with me? Okay, let's uh, go before flying. Wait, 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 wait. Hold wait, on. Please don't go. Hold on. No, I'm sorry, Cam, but this is whack. <laughs> Mermaid was black. What happened? What happened? Ariel, you been using that bleaching cream? What do you got that uh, revitiligo? Is that a Michael Jackson thing? I thought I thought she was supposed to be black. This ain't this ain't Little Mermaid. This ain't Ariel. This ain't my Little Mermaid. <laughs> Some of y'all do not get those jokes. All right, let's get back to the video. He said your shit was whack. <laughs> you had no clap Wait, back. Please don't go. I'm sorry, Cam, but this is whack. <laughs> you can't even clap back at that, honestly. Like, you just have to take that out. Camila, you're being very rude to Ariel. I don't care. I'm so tired of you and all your rules and restrictions. The music was lame. I hate this dress. And worst of all, you invited a Disney princess to my sweet 16. That's embarrassing. You ruined my party. Woo! 
You see, boom. Right? <laughs> She's all about her bag. I like that. I like that, Ariel. Keep that up. You see, like, we're seeing two different extremes. Like, we're seeing super controlling, and then we're seeing, like, hit super laid back. Uh, where's all we the need food? to hit that middle point. Everyone's starving. Food? I thought you were getting the food. No. I'm 16. You're the parent. You're supposed to take care of it. Says who? Last time I checked, this isn't my party. This woman should not have kids. See, oh, my you. goodness. So entitled. Jeez, Louise. Oh. All right, everybody out. Wait, wait, what is some, going some on? Some people We've should not have kids, and that, that woman is one of them. Out? This party is in violation of a noise she, code she, set in place by though. the neighborhood. Noise code? What even is that? Don't act like you don't know. It's in the contract. Th this skimming ass? No oh my gosh. This is better call oh, Saul skimming ass. I knew it. I him. knew it. Never trust a guy in a purple shirt. Never trust a guy in a purple shirt, guys. If you're wearing a purple shirt right now, you're an op. Thanks you're an op. You, you can't be trusted. Your party is destroyed. Thanks to me? What did I do? What didn't you do? You're supposed to help me. I don't know anything about contracts or even parties. I'm 16. I've been acting more like an adult than you have this entire time. <clears throat> I'm confused. I thought this is what you wanted. More freedom. You're starting to sound just like Camila. Mm. Had I known you were going to be such a headache, I would have never, ever agreed to this switch. Uh-uh. Damn. That's kind of like a... She is your headache now. I can't deal with her anymore. That's like a we not talking oh to gosh. each other kind of situation. What happened? Oh. Oh, you miss being controlled. Mom. Stockholm don't syndrome. Don't leave me again. Stockholm oh. syndrome. Stockholm okay. syndrome. What is going on with you guys? I thought you both hated us. We did. But we realized that you should always be careful what you wish for. Because the grass isn't always greener on the other side. Hold on, though. Hold on. This mom is still a piece of shit. Like, am I, am I, am I tripping? Like, she could at least, she could at the very least, very least, spend some more time with her daughter, right? Like, she didn't even say goodbye at the airport. You finna tell me that the, the people who learned the lessons are the daughters is not the parents? I'm not finished with the video. Let me finish first. Sorry, mom. I actually appreciate how easygoing you are. And I appreciate wow. how protective you are. Wow, oh, she just thanked her mom for being you, a honey, piece of shit who I've didn't care about her. That. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. I need to let off the brakes a little bit. There we go, there we go, there we go. There we go. It's your turn. What? <laughs> oh, I don't have to change. I'm perfect You're the horrible. way I am. You're horrible. Uh, okay, well maybe I can be a little more attentive. There you go. Okay, um... I'll do a 360. When did you get ah! these acrylics? They're just Darn way it. too long. I'm kidding. I knew she got them. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> ah, acrylics. Me personally, I'm not really into acrylics. All, in all honesty, I don't I, I can give a ass, ass about nails, man. Women... That's probably something that they do for themselves, because look, <clears throat> as long as it looks nice, like, you know, you don't have like claws and you keep them like manicured for the most part. Like women need $100, $200 every two weeks for their nails. The nails, this, nails, that, makeup, hair. It must be expensive being a girl. But then you realize that most of them ain't even paying it with their own money. You know, they're paying it with your money because <laughs> you're a simp. No, I've definitely paid for girls' nails. It's, it's, it's something you're going to do the older you get. <clears throat> if you have a girl and you're not paying for her nails, you're not paying for her hair, you're not paying for all of this, like, it may be okay. It may be okay, y'all. You know, it may be a mutual understanding. It may be okay. But I'm, I'm telling you, like, most women, if not all women, they kind of like it, if not expect it. To different degrees. I'm not saying you have to buy everything for that girl. I'm just saying, like, if you have been with a girl and you have never gotten her a single thing, she definitely noticed it and she definitely feels some type of way about it. All right. <clears throat> Let me go ahead and read these donations. Uh, Digr Digarock47, thank you so much for that dono. He said, been, been watching you since your clickbait days. Maybe I need to go back to the clickbait days because <clears throat> those were the days when I was getting mad views. I think like I was clearing like 12 to 14 million views a month. 
Now I get like seven to eight million views a month. Maybe I got to go back to the clickbait because I guess clickbait was working, right? I guess it was working, right? Uh, Drip it, you cheat ya ha. I guess that's a Naruto name. She said, Peter. <laughs> she really was looking like Lois Griffin. I don't know what she was thinking with that color or that bob cut, but it was not working for her. And Pixel Flan Mesito. Mes Sorry for pronouncing that wrong. I present to you my late fee, my good sir. <laughs> and by the way, you should see, you should read See You at Harry's by Joe Knowles. I bet you'll cry because I did. Read something that would make me cry? That's actually hard. It's easier for me to cry if I see something, like I watch something. But, you know, crying after a, reading a book? Is that possible? <laughs> like, you're, you know, you're looking through the pages. Oh, my God. <laughs> I need to see it. All right. Bride removes overweight. Bride's maid. She instantly regrets it. All right. So I, I, we're going to get a lot of fat shaming jokes, a lot of bigums, yeah. fat back jokes. Oh. Wow. Oils, you ladies that. look so... Oh, oh my no. gosh. I tried to get this. And they, they, it's like, they always using the same big girl. Like, I don't know, man. Like, you have to understand some part. Yes, you're you're acting for a part. You're acting for a scene. Yes, I understand that. But what did it get to you a little bit? <clears throat> like, if I was a Dark Man actor and every single role that they put me in was like, you know, some... A teacher who was white not liking me because I was black or something that had to do with my race. I'd be like, damn, I'm more than I'm more than my skin color, you know. Like she's more than a big person. Like y'all know what I'm trying to say. But it's like they say, all right, we're gonna make a big girl video. Hey, 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 Bethany, over here, over here, over here. Here, you know he gonna call for you. Holly, what? I'm just being honest. What about? Let me run this back because I was not listening. See those bridesmaids dresses. Ah. All right, first one looking good. Wow. Second one, all right, you nice. You ladies look so... Oh my gosh. I tried to get the zipper up, but it won't budge. Um, forget it's okay. the zipper. It looks like you're overstuffed Some... in meat trying to escape a sausage casing. Pally! Ooh. I'm just being honest. That was overboard. Hell no, that was not honesty. Can you try it? I hate people Here, like let that. Let me try helping you with the zipper. Who be saying, I'm trying to be honest, and they say the most vicious, it, outlandish shit ever. You know what? My dress feels a little snug, too. It must be a small make. I was working out for you ladies. Um, actually, could I get this dress in a bigger size? Oh. Is that the biggest size that they have? Yeah, let's take a look at M. Oh, I'm sorry. Ah, I'm this sorry. Is the largest size we carry in this dress. It's, it's not the dress that's the problem, Lori. It's your weights. And you need to do something about that. I can't have my maid of honor showing up to my wedding like this. I'm gonna ruin all the photos. Ugh. Fuck you in your photos. Like, it. now I'm not even coming to your wedding. Like, you are going to be the maid of honor to that woman? Are y'all even really friends? Skinny. We need to look this good. All right. First, we've got some grilled cheese bites with tomato soup. Grilled cheese oh, bites wow. with Thanks. tomato soup. That looks so good. My pleasure. That looks. What the hell was that? It's like some Disney scene. <laughs> they brush their hair to the side. They both lock eyes. The first one to drop his glare loses. So good. Who's gonna My drop pleasure. their glare first? Gonna drop it first. Ah, he dropped it. He dropped the glare. Dude, he dropped the glare. I think he likes you. You totally should talk to him. He's way out of my lane. You need more self confidence. What are you doing? You shouldn't be. Whoa. Eating. You should be fasting. But this Whoa. Is just a sample. I literally haven't eaten all day to prepare for this tasting. She slapped food out of your hand. Oh my god. Yo, if somebody slapped food out of my hand and said I need to be fasting. I think that that will be it. I think that will be it. That is what will turn me into Greg Duchette, bro. That will turn me into He-Man. I will be the rock. That would hurt me so bad. Like you literally slapped food out of my hand and said I need to be fasting. Like, like I'm trying to uh, build my connection with God. <laughs> Bruh, nah, nah. You should be fasting. I don't, I don't know like, how oh, you're her maid of honor. Screw I her. literally haven't eaten all day to prepare for this tasting. Can you say the same? She I said that so proudly. Because I want to look skinny for the wedding. She obviously. said, I totally haven't but been eating. But you're already so skinny. 
Yeah, and I want to keep it that way. Well, look like you. How are you friends with her? This, this, is this how girl relation, uh, friendships be? This is actually really good. Too bad you can't try any, because you know, you're fasting, right? Are you okay? Sometimes tomato soup gives me really bad heartburn. Does anyone have Tums? Come on, I need something. I feel like she's just being over dramatic. Like you have the, the smallest nibble, ratatouille ass nibble of that Excuse cheese stick. Me. Do you have any Tums? No, sorry. Uh, any chance you have a teaspoon of baking soda? Baking soda, I got baking soda. Wait, is that what Tums are? Just baking soda? Did I hear you say baking soda? You got mm -hmm. baking soda. Baking. baking soda neutralizes the acid in your stomach. So right. heartburn actually occurs when the stomach fluid goes back into your esophagus. Thank you. Baking soda can help with it. Oh, well, you know, he gave, he gave you a... Uh, uh... Drink this. <laughs> Sometimes I forget that you're a nurse. For all you know, he gave you, what is it, DH? I don't know. Excuse me. <laughs> he gave me that Joe Rogan shit. Wow, you can start feel seeing different better. galaxies. <laughs> that doesn't mean you should be eating. Oh my God. She slapped five, your hand six, twice. Five, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six. She slapped seven, your hand eight. twice, one, man. Two, three, that is crazy. Five, six, seven, eight. One, hey, two. neither of y'all have energy. Why did you stop the music? I don't have no okay? energy. You look a little off. Yeah, I'm, I'm just like a little lightheaded from not eating. I'm on this water diet. Do you want to take a break? A That's water a diet? <laughs> Maybe we should order some food if you mean, you're not feeling You mean well. survival? I, I don't want to eat anything right now. I still have a few months to go and I want to at least lose five pounds. So this woman let's just is in survival mode. All for a wedding photo. Actually, I need a minute. She's been, she, she hasn't been eating either, right? If I can right. power through with no food, you'll survive. From the top. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Four. I'm sorry, I can't. You ladies keep going now. Oh my God, you've got to be kidding me. You do realize why you can't keep up, right? It's your weight. You're too big. Been a roast. Look, you're my cousin and my maid of honor, so I'm not gonna sugarcoat it anymore. Your weight Ooh. is disgusting, Lori. Ooh. I love you and all, but I'm not gonna have you embarrass yourself and me on my wedding. Ooh. Come on, daggers! Lori, stop. Daggers! Pain. No, she needs to hear this. If you can't look, 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 look. Can't no, I'm gonna butt. let her finish her rant. I'm, I'm gonna let her finish no. her rant. She needs to hear this. Ah. If you can't fit your butt in that dress by the time we pick it up from the store, you're out of the bridal party. I'm dead serious. As serious as a heart attack. Woo! Look, man. Fat people, bro. <laughs> fat people know they're fat. Fat people know they are fat. So I don't even know why she's like, no, she needs to hear this. Like, they've been heard it their whole entire life. You do not need to tell a fat person that they're fat. They heard it from their mother. They heard it from their friends. They heard it from the people that aren't their friends. They heard it from guys that they talked to, guys that they didn't talk to, from people just in their school. And they probably heard it from themselves in their head every single second of the day. So calling a fat person fat is like one of the most like, you know, pointless things to do. They know they're fat. You know, if they want to change the situation, let them change. If they don't want to change the situa situation, then don't let them change. But calling somebody fat and just telling them they need to lose weight because they're fat, they know they're fat, yet they still haven't lost the weight. So what what good do you hey, think it's gonna do? Don't What's this mean? Me. Don't be mean. My cousin's just being a you total bridezilla right now. No, she's right. I do need to lose weight. This is her wedding and I wanna to try to make it work. I need to lose weight too, man. It's your body. I would show you all my shirt, but- You don't have to do anything uh, you don't want to do. And regardless, she shouldn't be talking to you that way. I'm not wearing bottoms. I know how important. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Kidding. No, now I have to show y'all because I don't want to get like in trouble for saying that. Yeah. I don't want to ruin this for her. Oh, hold on, hold on. Holy shit. Okay. I thought I just flashed the camera. I'm gonna lose the weight, and I'm gonna fit in that dress. I All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Come on, let's keep practicing. All right. Are we gonna lose the weight or? 
Hold on. Hold on. Are we gonna lose the weight or are we uh gonna make the dress bigger? Are we gonna stretch stretch that dress out? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I sit on one side, you stay on the opposite side, we just yeah! losing weight sucks. It sucks. Gotta be smaller. Damn, is she every single chance she gets to call her her friend fat. She calls her friend fat, bro. <laughs> As well. Alright, you almost there, you almost there. You got a girl? Almost there. Alright, it's probably it's probably done. Nope. <laughs> I don't know how people just get up like that. I need 30 minutes from when the alarm goes off to like, you know, realize where I am in the universe and what planet I'm on. I'd be so out of it when I first wake up. So out of it. Go ahead, girl. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, confidence. Yeah, slay. Damn. There we go. The dresses are all hanging for you girls. Okay. I'll be back and check on you later. Okay, I'll car, I'll car. Oh, wait, where's my dress? Oh, you got kicked out no of clue. the wedding. I Maybe. don't know. Hey, do you know where my dress is? Ooh, she's kicking you out. I'm sorry, Lori, but I decided to kick you out of the wedding party. Oh my gosh. I lost the weight. I've been dieting and exercising like crazy. Okay, not... You think you lost the weight, but you're still fat. Kelly, that's not fair. She worked really hard. This is not your friend, Kelly, or I'm whatever not... her, the fat, the big okay, one's name is. The wedding, Sorry. But you just. No, actually, I heard some people uh, don't consider fat to be a bad word. Like, they, they embrace it. They, you know, they're trying to take their word back. <laughs> like, we try to take our word back, but. I think I think we did a pretty successful job. It's just people can get, people can get over carried away. Can't be a bridesmaid. <laughs> Danny, will you be my maid of honor? <laughs> oh my gosh! Of course. <laughs> okay, I have the perfect shoes that'll match your dress. Come on. Honestly, you I'm just so suplex sorry. this bitch. Not her. The the, the one who kicked that. you out. Like, what more do you have to li lefty okay. lose? Just suplex yeah. her. I'll be fine. Hit her with a mean Hulk Hogan leg drop. I'm gonna go. I'll <laughs> see you at the wedding. Break through all the floors of that, uh, of that building. <laughs> She's on the 38th wow. floor. She's gonna make it you to the lobby. You look so beautiful. Thanks. What she has that? not been eating. You better faint okay. right before you say I do. I haven't eaten anything Girl, today. you need to get okay. some food. How great do I look in my dress? You do. All right, you're all done. Hey, Danny. Uh-huh. Can you bring me my vows? I want to practice before the wedding. Of course, it's in my purse. You forgot the vows because you're a terrible maid of honor. You see, uh, someone like me, I feel like I'm just go off the dome, bro. Like when I'm at, when I'm at the uh, altar, you know, vow propose, I feel like I'm just gonna go off the dome, right? Is that a bad idea? Is that stupid? Should I write something down? You're probably right. Damn, thanks, Tom. Tom's my imaginary friend. That's why I'd be talking to whenever like I'd be talking to y'all, but like I'm really talking to Tom. He's behind the camera. Y'all can't see him, only I can. What, Tom? Did you lose my vows? <laughs> of course not. Get it from MySpace, Tom? I just Tom? can't find them. He's what do everybody's you mean friend. can't find them? How could you lose my vows? I didn't mean to. Here, I'll help you look. Where's the last place you remember seeing them? I don't know. This is ri ridiculous. That's like one of your oh, jobs what? as a maid of honor. To have the vows. <gasps> oh my gosh, Kelly! I said vows like A, you B, C, D. You think it was her? I'm gonna go get help. Like A, E, I, O, U. I meant vows. <laughs> All right, Thickums, looking good. Oh, thank God. I was just about to call you. Come quick, we need you, it's Kelly. Oh yeah, she's a nurse. She's a nurse. Oh my gosh. Woo! Kelly. Kelly. Hey, Kelly. How did you fake all sexy oh like? Gosh. What? Kelly. <laughs> she even has to fake sexy. Hey, Kelly. <laughs> Kelly, come on, wake up. She said, even when I'm passed out, I slay. Uh, what are you doing? We need to elevate her feet so that the blood rushes back to her head. Here, grab that stool. Okay, okay. 
I'm gonna write this down just in case uh, some girl pass out around me, you know, so I can do the right thing. I feel like what I just said is gonna be taken out of context. Like, I was so dead serious. These girls be fainting out here. Anemic ass. Low, low iron. They don't be eating, bro. <laughs> Your blood there you go. Probably from not eating. Don't just you know if you don't easy. eat, like it, you, okay. it just slows your metabolism. You. Like you're welcome. You're only gonna do more damage than good. Now come on, let's get you to sit up. Do you really want to lose weight? We gotta get you ready to walk down. I, I know aisle. how to lose weight, guys. I, I can't. I have the magic Danielle formula. Danielle lost my bowels, now now everything is ruined. <laughs> no, it's not. It's fine. Just speak from your heart. I will literally freeze. I can't speak in front of people. I, I need something written down. Okay. I used to be like uh, her. Well, let's write it down then. All right. You why see, this is why you this is why you needed her Jack. in your wedding Anything party. Comes to mind. But you were so blinded by because she was I'm fat. Thinking right now. I can't. She had grandma. Sure. <laughs> Man, fat people would be nice Do to tell her. Do you cross mind giving us a moment? But then it's also like, you can't be fat and mean. Why don't you close your eyes? All right. Hey, all these fat jokes I'm making is okay. I myself, I'm fat and I used to be fatter. So it's okay if I make jokes like that. And you know I'm kidding. What are some things that you like about Jack? Okay, well, His money, his sir, car. He's kind. Okay. And I love that he knows me like the back of his hand. He knows your back what? pretty well. Well, he can always deal with me when I'm being a little crazy. Or always. a lot of crazy. <laughs> he's reliable. Jack hears it, she's like, there hmm, for me. maybe I shouldn't marry her. <laughs> always has my back. A lot of crazy. Oh my gosh, I was thinking I about you. Oh, Lori, I am so sorry for how I treated you. Oh no, bro. I got so stressed out with the wedding and I was just so obsessed with Oh no, you said I look like a pack of Jimmy Dean sausage meat coming out of the pack. Only be perfect if I don't know if I can look past that. I, I don't know. Can y'all? I, I don't know, bro. Photos. No, I was wrong for saying that to you. <laughs> you could only make the photos. So what do you say? I don't know, man. Like, again? I would say no. Come on, please. Please, say please, no. please, 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 please. Self-respect. Ah! Darn it. Damn, he horned up. <laughs> Y'all see the look on his face? He can't wait to consummate, consummate that marriage. Bro, whoa, okay, man. I like, I like it. You know, that's how I want to look at my wife on my wedding night. Man, I've been talking about weddings a lot on this channel. It's because I'm getting older. A lot of my friends are being married or having kids. <sighs> I'm getting older, man. I'm getting older. It's kind of a bittersweet feeling. Girl. What she think she doing? What she think she doing, bro? <laughs> this is a phone in an aux course. You over here acting like she DJing. Like, girl, stop it. You know I'm funny, loops. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Of course, you have a DJ at your wedding. I'm kidding, guys. You were so good. I can't believe you remember the routine. I might have been practicing. I'm sorry. I couldn't. I wouldn't be able to look past it. You're the only one that noticed. You were absolutely incredible. No, I wasn't. <laughs> I'm serious. I had no idea you could dance so well. And you know what's funny? You look amazing in this dress. A lot of guys. Oh, you're going to make me blush. A lot of guys would smash kidding. a big girl. Keep going. <laughs> as long as nobody knows yeah. about it. <laughs> tried to throw the bouquet. As long as there. nobody finds out. <laughs> tell you. Your homeboy. He smashed a big girl. There's, no, there's nothing wrong with it, bro. I, I've done it before, too. I smashed, I smashed a big girl. This, that's me on camera saying it. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'd be cracking myself up. Finished.
Thank you so much for being a member for 21 months, man. Hope you make it to the whole uh, two year, bro. He said, I'm here. Oh, no, be scared. O only thing I should be scared of is, uh, 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 I don't know, bro. You should be killing it with those donations. So I'm actually not scared. I'm happy. Oh, some more Vaseline. I don't, I don't know if y'all know this, but talking a lot uh, makes your mouth dry. All right, let's get into the next video. <clears throat> Waitress hospitalizes customer. What happens next is shocking. Damn. Damn. What, what kind of waitress is hospitalizing a customer? She must have a mean right hook on Come her. Come on, man. I'm going to be late for this meeting. Oh. Her clutz. Did you crack the screen? Yeah. That sucks. You got some bad luck. You never know what's good luck or bad luck. Sometimes things turn out to be a blessing in disguise. Girl, your phone Powell screen is, is smashed. Screen <laughs> right? <laughs> Quit it. <laughs> oh, my God. What? Your phone done, done got smashed, and you say, you know, maybe it's a good... You know what? You, let me be more optimistic. Maybe Wait, it what? is a good sign. You see what's going on here? <laughs> is it me? Is it me? What? Are they waiting for an Uber? Or hey, what? buddy. Or What's going on, man? Ballet, we ballet. were here waiting way before she was. I'm sorry, sir. Your car's next. I'll go grab it right now. Oh, thank you. Got one job to do, man. Can, can this day get any worse? You know, maybe it's a good thing that he didn't pull your car up first. Here we go. Here we go. Look, there's no way that you're going to convince me that she must be into zodiac signs. Is a good thing. And okay, birdie, uh, uh, what you, uh, incense. These, like, spiritual people. She has crystals. Please. Yep. Oh wow, maybe you should listen to her. Okay. Okay, maybe oh you should God. listen to her more often. That, that could have been me. It could have been you, bro. Okay, that's so Raven. If you can see into the future, dun, 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 you think that life will be a breeze. Life is not a breeze. See you trouble from a distance. Yeah, go Raven. Well, it's not that easy. Oh no. That's so right. All right, all right, y'all don't want to hear me sing. She's gorgeous. Y'all saying please no, so oh God no. All right. It's a little old fashioned, but. Okay. Wait, how's she looking? How's she looking? She's so smart and successful. Ain't one can. Let me see, let me see. How, how your girl looking? Wow. Ain't one can. She's gorgeous. He on, he on Google Images. Yeah, she's so smart and successful. He Google serves pretty black women. It's okay. <clears throat> Can't wait to finally meet her in person. She says she's wearing a red dress. Oof. Damn. Red dress. My, aren't you a dashing <laughs> young man? <laughs> I must say, Ain't no way this is real. More handsome in person. Ain't no way this is real, bro. Someone's pranking you. Uh, Someone's pranking you. Stephanie. Yes. Uh, you, uh, you, you, you don't, you, you, you don't look nothing like your photos up here. You look younger. Oh well. The app said to upload my best pictures. Oh my so gosh. I used ones from my 20s. Your 20s or the... <laughs> uh, um, look, Stephanie. Nah, Stephanie. I... Nah, Stephanie. I don't rock with this. I don't rock with this. I don't rock with this at all. You can't be that senile where you didn't realize that, like, the point of uploading your best pictures and so people know how you look like. Nah, I'm not buying it. I'm not buying it. You knew what you were doing. You knew what you were doing. You, you, you was on the hunt. You was on the hunt. What do you even call women? She's not a cougar anymore. What do you call women this age? I don't even know what they call them at this age. Call me Steph. Oh, no! Okay. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but uh, I don't think this is going to work out. Oh, my gosh. Because... I'm a little a lot older than you. Expected. Yes, you catfished me. You need to remember that age is but a number. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Jeffrey Epstein. <laughs> okay, um um who Maybe else? To you. Um but when I see <laughs> Whatever. you I think about my grandma. And uh, I don't want to be dating my grandma. And so um best of luck to you on the app though. And um Maybe you should change that photo of yours into something more recent. I got all dressed up for this. 
The least you could do is buy me dinner. No! What? Oh, God, what? Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh no. I just got catfished. You got catfished and you still got water thrown in your face. Ain't that crazy, bro? Isn't that crazy? No, I, I would need to come after her, get her pension or something. Do you know how much I pay for this suit? Her retirement fund and, uh, or something, bro. I drove bro. all the way down to the city and paid $20 for parking. And for what? I could have been home in my PJs. Relax. I am not patronizing. You, you could have just, serious. you know, struck it. <laughs> what? what you... Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> I don't know if I ever said this on the stream before. I probably have, but if I haven't... Guys, this is yeah, this is this is some facts. This is some some knowledge, some advice only for the men. It's only gonna apply for the men. Look, look, look. If you ever, ever have an important decision that you need to make, something that like you really have to sit and think on, think about it right after you know you, you give yourself a little a little uh you know <laughs> a little a little fun, a little pleasure. <laughs> After you, you rubbed one off, think about it right after that. I'm telling you, that's when your mind is crystal clear. That's when you're, when you're focused in on life, when you know what you really want, that clarity. Ah! I'm telling you, do it, do it, man. It works. You just do it in, you know, locations where you can do it. Don't be in like the middle of a parent teacher conference. And you're like, uh, one second. Like what? Look, I recently just learned what you might think is bad luck may actually be good luck. Are you really trying to find a silver lining of me being catfished? You know, that sounds so stupid, just like that old lady. Is this seat taken? Is that oh. my girl? No. Oh! So, uh, <laughs> this seat is not taken. Uh, <laughs> Neither is this seat. This seat right here isn't taken either. Oh, you don't want to sit there? You had to sit in the normal chair? All right, it's cool, it's cool. Just want you to let you know, you know, <laughs> have a spot for you. Whole section <laughs> reserved with your name on it. It's all yours. God! I really like your suit. I really like your God! This whole thing, it's, it's new. <laughs> um, but I wasn't so sure at first. Are you waiting for anyone? Uh, no. No, I'm not. Yeah, Lee. Neither am I. Woo! I'm not gonna say I told you so, but aren't you happy that you're not at home wearing your PJs? Oh, I bet. I bet he is happy as hell now. This just seems way too good to be true, bro. Wow. Hello? She wasn't this a hooker. Is my bestie, Becca. Becca, this is the guy that I was oh. telling you about. Is, is this gonna be oh, the bestie that old. hates she her man? She told me you're a total creep. Oh. I kid. I oh my kid. gosh. She, she's going to be one of those. Absolutely adorable. I feel like she's going to be a and hater. She made the first move a little yep. lame on yep. your part. She's a hater. But I get it. Can hater. Jesus. So men could be intimidated to make the first move on her. Becca. What? I, be I bet you Becca's Becca be single. I bet you Becca is alone and single. I guarantee you. She is alone and single. I promise you that, guys. Oh, I promise God. you that. French latte for Paige. She's one of those. She's one of Seriously? those. Seriously? I ordered my coffee way before she did. I always has an issue first. with That's everything. Well, who knows? Maybe it's good luck that you didn't get yours first. Okay, now that's the dumbest thing I heard all day. Be nice, Becca. I'm just saying, how could it be good luck? <gasps> oh my gosh, I just burned my tongue. This latte is <clears throat> way too hot. I'm, I'm so sorry, ma'am. I put it on the wrong setting. Uh, ma'am, are, are you okay? No. I'm not okay. I just burnt my tongue. You know, you would really think that you have some sort of responsibility to your customers to make sure that they're okay. Okay, well, maybe what Can't you sue somebody, somebody out of this? Because I'm pretty sure the, the woman who uh, spilled the coffee uh, from uh -huh. McDonald's on her lap, <laughs> she got like freeze. millions yeah, of dollars for it. Did you have a reservation? Oh, she, <laughs> you know, I'll burn a little bit, a bit of tongue. Thank you. Yeah. We're so excited. We are wonderful things. Oh. Yes. Right this way. After you, you, Yo, this guy is just always Ooh. like ri he white rich money. Like he plays that per that role perfectly. Of course. And your server. Like, I look at him and I see you, banker, you investor, you. hedge fund manager. Like, he plays that role to the T, man. How are you both doing tonight? Very well, thank you. It's date night. Oh, how fun! Mm -hmm. um, have you dined with us before? Oh, is that Excuse Aubrey? Me, is that Aubrey? Um, I'm so Champagne sorry. Poppy. A few 
just excuse me for one moment? I think it's Champagne Poppy. Is everything okay? Hello, no. Hey. hey. Look at my face. Drake, oh, I went to your concert the other week. I specifically asked for no sesame seeds. I am so sorry. I told the kitchen myself and I made a note, but the chef must have missed the note. Um, what is going on over here? The chef missed the note about the sesame allergy. Are you saying my chef made a mistake? Um, <clears throat> yes, because he did. You can check the order. I wrote it down. Rat! Damn! Come here! You don't want to go back in the kitchen and ask Did him? Did you see a note about a sesame seed allergy? Nope. Hm. Oh, she she messed yeah. up. Woo! That settles it. You're fired! What? No. In front of everybody that's like that's this? Okay, hey, black man. My restaurant, my rules. Ugh! Kidding me? These yo stomping Please, grounds! No, I mean, I have Let's go! Bills to pay. I have my student loans from culinary school. Boo hoo! This no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. That is sad. That is sad. unfair. If you just look at the note. Do it look like I care? <laughs> just take off that apron and get out of my restaurant. This guy is the perfect Tyler Perry villain. Dark skin and bald. That's all you need to be. Get! <laughs> he said get! <laughs> That's what people from the South say. Where he from? Get. <laughs> I've only heard people from the South say that. Get. <laughs> of course the meals are on the house. Thank you. I cannot believe Hell yeah, the meals are on the house. Fire. I almost died. I have rent coming up next week and my student loan payments are coming up again. And this is so unfair. He said, get. Worst luck in the entire world. Like a dog well, on your couch. Maybe in a <laughs> way get. Really? And how exactly would me getting fired? Oh, you bet. You better get an upgrade. Excuse me, I'm so sorry for interrupting, but I overheard that you had gone to culinary school. Is that correct? Yeah, uh, my dream was to be a chef. Waitressing is just Woo! a temporary thing. You better have a big come up. Um, I guess the uh, stars must be aligned because I am opening up a new restaurant and we are looking for a, a good chef. Um, I overheard what happened earlier, so I'm so sorry for that. Uh, here's you really gonna hire somebody who just got fired me. for messing up a food allergy? That's if you're interested. Are you wow. Yes, I'm serious. How are, how are you? Yes, a, um, how are you yes, a business thank owner? you. I will definitely be giving you a call. Someone yeah, could have died over that, right? I mean, at the same time, like, why are you ordering a dish that has something you're allergic to? I've got an Uber on the way. To I'm sure there's the other things on the menu. See, you getting fired was actually good luck. Now you can do what you've always loved. I mean, being a chef. You're right. I guess that things that seem like bad luck sometimes are a blessing in disguise. Oh, hey, it's here. Let's go. <laughs> you ain't coming in my car looking like that. <laughs> I can't believe that waitress. You don't know if it's her fault. She said she had the allergy. Oh, wow. Like, this story is, like, leading from one to the other. I like this kind of timeline that they're doing. It's not, like, one focal point, one story. It's, like, an ongoing story where it, it goes from one uh, set of characters. In it. I like this. I like this kind of... Of, so of storytelling. Look at my face. I, I have things to do. I don't have time to be sitting He says, I have bitches to get. <laughs> I can't be looking like this. But maybe this is a good thing. I feel you, homie. I know. I know. You look like you have perks on your face, bro. The waitress who got fired seems like she may be getting a better job. Just trying to look on the brighter side. I don't think there is a bright side to this atrocity. You'll be fine, bro. Champagne poppy. Bitches love Here you. Here is your medication, Ethan. Thank you. Just take those as instructed on the bottle, and everything should clear up in the next 48 hours. Okay. 48 <laughs> hours. And I'm actually really glad you came in, Ethan. Why is that? Well, oh, while I was going over your blood work. There's something else that he would abnormality. And he would have never knew cells. about it if. Okay. Okay, oh. What does that mean? It looks like you have cancer. How is that a good what? thing? It better be curable. Cancer? It better be the most curable, curable. It's scary, but the good news is that we caught it really early. All right, bet, so bet. going to be fine. You can start with that then. Thank goodness you came in today. If you hadn't, it could have been quite the opposite story. Start with that. Let's start with... 
I have cancer. Start with, you are going to be fine. However, we found a little go. cancer, you're you know, just set. a little bit, a little smidgen. Hi there. Hi. What can I do for you today? Um, I accidentally dropped my phone. We're coming back full circle, guys. I fix it today. It, it's under warranty, so. Ooh, uh, unfortunately, we're all out of these screens at the moment. Okay. Uh, which means, since this wasn't your fault, I'll give you a free phone upgrade instead. How's that sound? <laughs> Sounds like a blessing in disguise. To you know, me. this never happens right. in real life. Okay, thank you. You know, these employees will never <laughs> go out their way to help you. That's all you have to say? Oh, I can't believe this. I seriously have the worst look. Hey! That was dope, bro. That was dope. I actually kind of like that. That was probably my favorite one so far. Like the way that they uh, kept the story going, switching from one set of characters to the next. I like that kind of storytelling. It was very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Indeed, indeed. All right. <clears throat> uh, Nadir, thank you so much for those donos. Appreciate those so much. My boy Ryan Garcia said, hey, Prince, I hope you're having a good day. I remember that someone said that you were going to get a custom Game Boy. What happened to that? Lay fee, by the way. Yeah, somebody did tell me that. Um, I don't know, bro. I don't know what happened to it. I have no clue what happened to it. If y'all know what happened to it, let me know. <laughs> All right, this one is called 16-Year-Old Abandons His Parents. What happens next is shocking. Let me hold it. go ahead and turn it up a little bit for y'all. Oh, wait, we're eating hamburger helper again? I'm sorry, sweetie, but that's all we can afford right now. You know, when I was a kid, there was days that we didn't even have any food. So, what's that got to do with me? Well, all I'm saying is sometimes you don't know what you got until it's gone. Mm. I mean, I would have killed to have some hamburger helper when I was at your age. Okay. Hamburger helper. Never. I used to love eating that Did you know when I was Daddy younger. And I actually met when we were your age. Uh, I remember it like it was yesterday. And you were still wearing the same bracelet. I know, I know. Mama was in the cafeteria, she was the new girl, yada yada. And I didn't know where to sit at lunchtime, and there's this really cute boy named Joey who asked me to sit by him. Oh he my gosh. My this is the kind of story I want to tell my kids whenever. The rest is history. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah, so let's talk about something that doesn't want to make me puke. Maybe like a new iPhone? What about it? <clears throat> oh yeah, hey. Um, yeah, when can I get a new upgrade so I don't have to use this piece of crap? <gasps> Brandon, you know our situation. We will get you a new phone as soon as possible. But everyone else has one. This is so dumb. Hey! Ooh. Watch that tone, young man. Put some bass in that voice. You two are so annoying. Wow. I wish you two never met. Wow! Oh, You're an idiot, bro. That's why you that's why you tripped over that chair. <laughs> Like everyone like when else your parents, has fives. Like when your parents are yelling at you and they stutter over a word, you try not to laugh. <laughs> no, no. And when your parents are trying to like whoop you with a belt or something and they actually hit themselves with it. <laughs> but the, the thing that sucks about that is like, you you know, like after they hit themselves with it, they're going to get more pissed. That next hit that's coming for you. Oh, they're going to double the force, man. New shoes and new phones. They're going to Kyle Ken that hoe. Are the worst. Are you even listening? I'm sorry, I've, I've just, I've finally figured this out. This nigga's trying to be static oh, shock that? over here. Or Miles Morales. He's it's cooler right now. a time machine. All right. <clears throat> yeah, right. I swear. No, it, it works. I wish it did, man. I would go back 25 years ago and make it to where my parents never met. So, so you Are just serious, you bro. just in high All school making time machines. Just type in how many years you want to go back in the past and hit the call button. When you are ready to come back to the present, just hit the pound key and uh What? Yeah. What are you doing in school, bro? NASA should be recruiting you. Yeah, you Neil. Out of Nigga, take us to Mars. The hell? Like he's in middle school doing okay, what? See this. Uh, so I'm just gonna put this find out this right? actually worked. It's probably just gonna give him Press brain damage. Right and then magically just Whoa, whoa, whoa! That was just, it, it, just oh, like a normal, yeah. another normal day to him. Yeah. Who is he? We need oh. you, bro. What? <laughs> oh man. Man, 
and invented a whole time Ew, machine. I had the crazy right before shit. lunchtime. All the all the Oda Max. Oh my gosh. It worked. Joey, make a move already. Lay off. I will. Dad? Well, you better hurry. All right, she's the new girl in school. All right, so you better act fast before she meets someone else. Like, the only guy who's into her. I get it. Dude. He's just a little nervous, Ew. man. Give him some time. You know, it's easy to be the guy Wait a minute. who is not trying to go after the girl saying, they haven't met bro, me. go after her, go after her. Because you're not going after her. You don't have anything to be nervous about because you're not trying to go after her. You know, you got to give him some time, you know? All right. <clears throat> Let's see. Who do we have? And which one's your mom? My old man's passing down his multi-million dollar company to me once he decides to hang up his boots. Wait, he's really going to hoe his dad and get his mom to meet up with another guy that way. Bro, you wouldn't even be born. You wouldn't be born. Like, I don't know. That's that's too confusing. Off rip, you won't look the same, but you being born, you don't know. Hey, you wouldn't be born. what's up, man? You're killing yourself. <laughs> Do I know you? Yeah, I've, I'm your future. S Never mind. Uh, see that pretty girl right there? She is super into you, man. Ha <laughs> ha. Never talked to her before. Uh, yeah, well, uh, she's new. Her name's Libby. You should go introduce yourself, like right now. <clears throat> but I don't know anything about her. Okay, well, uh, her favorite color's purple. Um, she's a Gemini. She loves pickleball, and her favorite movie is Legally Blonde. Okay? All right. What's pickleball and Legally Blonde? <laughs> uh, just compliment her hair, and she'll love you. Okay? All right, go for it, man. Hey, Joey, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, you are? Um, I'm born. Later, fam. <laughs> you a hoe, bro. You literally killing yourself. <laughs> oh, fam. Because they didn't say it back then. Uh, you see? It'll, be it'll be interesting to, you know, travel back in time, but, you know, I'm black, so I probably wouldn't have as great an experience as someone like he would. <laughs> Uh, I don't. You can't go back too far now. <laughs> no. Uh, I think work, man. I would max I out at. To someone else. I think as a black person, the furthest I would go back would be maybe like the late seventies. Maybe, maybe I would. I would. I would have no reason to go back in time. What does back in time have for me, bro? Whoa! Why do I sound like this? Oh, he looks different uh, now. Is he a girl? Is it's he, not he, just how you sound. Is he blonde? Oh, I got the new iPhone. <laughs> you're blonde. What the heck? And you're rich. I mean, you have a new dad. What'd you expect? He feeling it? Okay. He feeling it. I'm rich? Oh, this is fire. And I've got a maid? Hey. <laughs> Man, that would be the life, right? That would be, whoo! Look at that bed. No way! Dude. I have a PS5 and an Oculus? How broke were you? Neil the genius! You didn't have a PS5? <laughs> now let me not say that. A lot of, of y'all don't have PS5s. They're expensive. What do you want from me? <clears throat> You promised you would change. Oh, come on, Lib. Uh, you caught him Never with someone else. Never rich, successful man cheats. Yep, you know I knew you it. signed up for when you married me? I married you because I loved you. Not so you could betray me every chance you get. This was the last straw. I think every successful man cheats. I want a divorce. I think 90% of them do. Fine. Hope you enjoy losing everything. Did you forget about our little prenup? I don't care about your Ooh. money. But nice. I'm taking nice. Brandon with me. You got that prenup. <laughs> nice. No, you're not. Oh, yeah? Well, I wonder what the judge is going to think when I tell him you have been unfaithful our entire marriage. You have proof? If you learn nothing. He ain't got no proof. It never happened. Money. Yeah. I have all the lawyers. Yeah. You have nothing. You have Brandon. Everything you have. <laughs> it's because I bought for you. Light her ass up. A little life. Light her ass up. Light it up. And you can believe me when I say that you're never going to see Brandon again. Now get out of here. Light her up. Look, look, look. The only reason why I'm saying light her up is because 
This goes back to my point when I say I want a wife who works. Because if you ever get to these, this crossroad where like y'all want to leave each other this and that, or even if you never get to those crossroads, you never want your guy to be able to say something like this to you. This is for all of my ladies out there. Do you want your guy to be able to say something like this to you? That I bought you everything. You wouldn't have anything more than for me. This is my house. Like you have no career, no skills. You are basically at the mercy of a man. And if he just suddenly doesn't like you no more, like you will be low key kind of screwed because you signed a prenup. Why would you want to live that way? That's scary, right? How do you feel about your little wish, Timmy Turner? So, or uh, how's the new life? It was time Seems travel. like Not it's really uh, terrible. I was way off setting my mom up with that jerk. Why don't you go back in time and stop slaving? <laughs> How would one go back in time? You know what? Y'all don't care about that. But that is an interesting thought. Uh, a little thought game. If you had a time machine and you can go back in time and go back forward in time, you know, to see how the uh, changes you made in the past reflected the future, how exactly would you stop slavery? Like, what would be the steps to stop it? I, I, that's an interesting, you know, little... Oh. I don't know the word I'm thinking... Um, you know, mm, but sorry. Little thought game. So, uh, what are you gonna do now? The only thing I can do. <clears throat> go back in time. You're getting addicted to it, man. It's not a game, man. This is real life. Back to life. Back to re. All right, okay, so, damn. Damn, bro, you just pimping out your mom like this? Low key. Low key, that is exactly what he's doing. And his mom is just saying yes to everybody who, who talks to her. Yo, mom, easy. If I'm learning anything from this video, is that your mom is easy. Okay, his dad is an army dad, it seems. Or maybe he's just in the National Guard. He's not really in the army. Oh no, he's an army dad. Yep. <laughs> Give me a new pops. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me a new pops. Give me a new pops. I need to return my dad, please. Go back in time, bruh. No, nah, but like, am I not wrong? Like, is his mom not kind of easy? Like every single guy, the first guy that is presented right in front of her face, she marries them? Sheesh. All right, who, who, who's the next one that's gonna take your mom? He is pimping his mom out, right? The magician? Why the magician? I feel like that's just gonna make your odds even worse. Okay. A guy who likes rats. You're letting the entire school hit with your mom, bro. I hope you know this. <laughs> All right, uh, bad boy drummer. You know, he had to bring his drumsticks to let you know he a drummer. Oh, no. He's just experiencing all these new lives. Out of all of them, I would say I'll go with the rich one. I'll go with the rich one. I'm sorry. No, but like my parents were happy together. But then again, I was rich. <laughs> all right, there we go. I actually uh, help. Like I was rich, so you know, how upset could I have really been? I have gone through so many dads, and every time my life gets worse. My mom's been ran way through, bro. Worse. Gosh. Well, you can't keep trying to get it right forever. In fact, based on my calculations, you get one have more try. Two jumps left. Oh. Uh, one jump. Yeah, no, nah, you got one jump left, and it'll automatically bring you back here before it dies. You will have no control over it. I mean, zero. What? All right, well, looks like I better make this one count. <sighs> what a waste of technology, man. What a waste of technology. This guy went back in time. <laughs> so the, the whole school can, can run a train on his mom, bro. Hey, what are you doing in here? What? Crazy. Well, school's over. Computer lab's closed. Scram. Over. But can't be. What happened? Oh, no. What did you do? Oh, no. 
sent me to the wrong point in time? Huh? <gasps> oh, the wrong point. So he is back in time, but not at the correct time, so, like four o'clock, five o'clock. Okay, no, yeah. No, I'm too late. You don't want to be rich? If I can just go back in time a little further. What? You gotta think of something Spat. quick. Kick him in the nuts oh, or something, bad. bro. Or I don't know. Hey, you know Joey, right? Uh, yeah. What's up? What's up? Doesn't matter. <laughs> you know where he is, like right now. No. My whole future depends on this, man. Okay, so Why? I need you to run over to school yes, real quick and, and beat. No. <laughs> but there's no time for that because. What? Whoa. Oh my gosh. This is where you live? How are you gonna barge in someone's house and be like, this is where you live? Water? Cereal with water? Okay. Okay, man. You can just eat the cereal and drink the water, bro. You don't. Oh my god. Uh, oh. oh. <laughs> He really barged in yo crib and said, you live like this? <laughs> anyway, I need you to come with me, like right now. What? Where? Uh, you know Libby, right? The new girl? She really wants you to ask her on a date. He said, like, you now. live like this? Really? <laughs> and, and, and go where? Uh, the mall. Because she has another day and you have to ask her before the other day asks her. Yo, her. I'm dead, bro. Yeah. Uh, I'll explain on the way. Wait. Do you Cereal and water. Any other clothes, maybe? And you insulting his drip? Uh, no, not really. I mean, okay, yeah, you probably want to. Yeah, give him your fit, you know? Ooh, Let him look ooh. all Metallica out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Perfect. Ooh. She's alone. I don't think I know a single Metallica Are song. You're supposed to go up to her? I probably Let's do, I just don't know the title uh, of it. Compliment her hair. Oh, and mention her braided bracelet. Don't worry, the rest will take care of itself. How can you be so sure? Just trust me. Okay. Trust me, Dad. Listen, I'm gonna distract him. You go Wait, hold on. Okay, and don't screw this up. Is Both this the plot line of Back now. to the Future? Because I've okay. never seen that movie. What does that mean? It is. Hey, I'm gonna feel so Richie, stupid. Right? Um, uh, I have a really important message uh, from Richie, your Richie, dad. Richie, Richie, It's it's about your uh inheritance. Ooh, money talk. About? Money uh, talk. Look, man, he uh, needs to talk to you. Like, gotta cut you out right of the will. He said, uh, you don't go home? You're, you're out of the will. You're out of his will. Ooh, what'd I say? Gone. It's time to go home, bro. <laughs> Sorry, man. The... What? No. Oh. oh, it's time to go oh, home. No, 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 please, it's too soon. You no, have to hope your dad had the Riz. Did your dad have the Riz? Did your dad have the Riz? Let's find out. Oh, thank you. Woo! Thank you, God. It's all back to normal. You're back. He had the Riz. Um, he had the Riz. It didn't even mean much. Like his mother literally married. Y'all know. Y'all know. His mom was easy. Good mood. <laughs> <laughs> Son, uh, your mom uh, and I are talking, and we feel really bad about the whole phone. He literally I showed her. I don't care about the phone. A man who had a rat, or a rat hobby, of it. and she I'm married just so him. I'm so happy you two are my parents. I love you guys so much. Oh, uh, sweetheart. <laughs> We love you too. This was a, this is a, a good video. You were so mad at us earlier. <laughs> I guess I just realized sometimes you don't know what you have until it's gone. Mm. <laughs> wow, that's mm. a change of heart just one day. Mm. Well, feels a little bit longer than that. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh. I can laugh with you. I'm inside with the joke too. Wait, 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 wait. What? What? Is that something important? Hey, he's there in the background. He's there in the background. He's there in the background. That's crazy. I feel like y'all should, know. you know what? You know what? We're just gonna let that slide. That's a cool little, little note they did. There he is in the background when his parents met. Wow, that's cool. That was dope. Whoever wrote that story. R round of applause, round of applause, round of applause. All right. I actually plan to stream like for like a whole other hour, but your boy has stuff to do. So I will be cutting this stream uh, a little short. It's still been a, it's still been a bit over two hours, but I was planning on uh, streaming for like three hours. 
So um, next stream that you get, it'll probably be The Wolf Among Us. I'm also planning on starting Mortal Kombat story mode, just a story mode. I think that'll be fun and interesting to play. And you know, it's relatively new. So y'all you know, just either watch your favorite YouTuber play story mode or you play the story mode. So it's still a little fresh on your mind. So, you know, thinking that would be a game that I can play as well as Wolf Among Us because Wolf Among Us, I can probably knock out the game in one more live stream. That'll probably be like a four hour, five hour live stream. I don't know, we'll find out anyways. Yo, 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 Big D Chainsaw, are you gonna play Marvel Spider-Man next month? Honestly, that feels like a game I wanna play like just by myself, just relaxing, just chilling, you know, not really focused on anything. So, I don't know, I may play it, I may not. There's no promises, but I may do it. And Rafa Zanik said, Fallout 4, Fallout 4, Fallout 4. Well, I guess he really wants me to play Fallout 4, but there's something about me, first person shooters, I am garbage at it. And what I don't want to happen is me playing a first person shooter and y'all are just in the chat saying I'm garbage and I suck and why am I even here and all that. But yeah, thank you for coming to this live stream. Please hit that subscribe button, hit a like on this video if you were entertained. Uh, hit the notification bell, that way you're always notified whenever I go live or I post a video. Until next time, it's been your boy Prince O'Hawkum. Stay charming, my friends. Woo! Gotta, gotta always end it off with the Ric Flair. Woo! No, I am in Ric Flair room. This is a charming.